Yo, it's Teebs. So yeah, man, Outriders demo's out. You guys should check it out. Pretty cool. So it's kind of curious why there is four different classes in Outriders, but there is only a three-player co-op, which means there's a good chance you're not going to have a full team of four different classes because you could only have a three-player co-op. So I had to look that up, man. So basically, straight from the devs, they tested different amounts of players in co-op. But they found that three players was the perfect max player sweet spot for balancing, optimization, and visibility. Especially with all the movement skills and visual effects from all of your abilities. They said when playing with four people on the battlefield, it got way too chaotic and way too hard to read. Probably from all the abilities going out everywhere. And it makes sense, man. But it's nice though, I do find three player co-op to be pretty good. Uh, especially with the um, like uh, battlefield size. I don't know if you know in Rift Town. I forget what that those enemies were called. The Hounds? Were, was it the Hounds? I hope I'm not messing that up. But I think it was the Hounds. But maybe I'm completely wrong. In that basement there. It was pretty uh, congested right? Like you just have enemies coming at you. And I could definitely see four people in that area making the game a little chaotic. Whereas like the open areas, maybe not though. But I guess for most of the areas, having four players would be a little uh, congested for sure. But yeah, if you're ever wondering why there's four classes but three co-op players available, that's why. Basically, three players is the sweet spot for balancing, optimization, and visibility. Since I'm learning this stuff, reading i would just make a video so because videos are way easier to consume instead of doing all this reading stuff man it's hard but that's it for the video it's been teebs peace out